Rosalind T. Lodge. There is a great and hopeful longing in the author for a fair Rosalind. It is detailed as though she can be observed closely. It reminds me somewhat of Song of Solomon. It's full of her descriptions. She is rich, star-like hair, I think is blonde, and she seems to be a young lady, Fair Rosalind. Her hair can be either loose or in braids when she's been observed. Um, is that Was that wink old enough to flirt or a hopeful flirt? He dares to dream. This pink-cheeked young miss more sighing and dreaming. Should this be fair, Rosalind? Delightful descriptions of the fair Rosalind abound. She even outshines the heavens. And finally, he's not just wishing but praying that she could be his. Rosalind is ethereally beautiful, no doubt, and perhaps her personality does not matter other than her divine virtue mentioned. I would like to know more of her story as well. Like to the clear in highest sphere, where all imperial glory shines, of self same color is her hair, whether unfolded or in twines. Hey ho, fair Rosalind. Her eyes are sapphires set in snow, resembling heaven by every wink. The gods do fear when ace they glow, and I do tremble when I think, hey ho, would she were mine. Her cheeks are like the blushing cloud that beautifies Aurora's face, or like the silver crimson shroud that Phoebus smiling looks doth grace. Hey ho, fair Rosalind. Her lips are like two budded roses, whom ranks of lilies neighbor nigh, within each which bounds she balm encloses apt to entice a deity, hey ho, would she were mine. Her neck is like a stately tower, where love himself imprisoned lies, to watch for glances every hour, from her divine and sacred eyes, hey ho, for Rosalind. Her paps are centers of delight, her breasts are orbs of heavenly frame, where nature molds the dew of light, to feed perfection with the same. Hey ho, would she were mine. With orient pearl, with ruby red, with marble white, with sapphire blue, her body every way is fed, yet soft in touch and sweet in view. Hey ho, fair Rosalind. Nature herself her shape admires, the gods are wounded in her sight, and love forsakes his heavenly fires, and at her eyes his brand doth light. Hey ho, would she were mine. Then muse not, nymphs, though I bemoan the absence of fair Rosalind, since for a fair there's fairer none, nor for her virtues so divine. Hey ho, fair Rosalind, hey ho, my heart, would God that she were mine.